Hello there guys, Coast Chal here, Dongster Born, but built for theme parks, and welcome to a theme park news you update where today Kentucky Kingdom have been officially teasing hashtag a new story. We don't know what this is. We're going to look at potential themes, potential investments, what this could be, and all that jazz. A lot of people have been joking on social media on T4, you know, like another SLC, but we know that's not going to be the case. Uh, but I've seen loads of different rumors being speculated online. Um, new rides, new roller coaster. Um, you know, a new themed area, maybe a new buyer for the park, you know, everything's been speculated. So I'm going to go through my top three speculations about what I think it could be. So before we get started, guys, make sure you like the video, comment down below, subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss another YouTube video. Also, guys, check the description down below when I only can you find links to Twitter, TikTok, TikTok, Instagram, Snapchat, and also the Discord server where you, yes, you, the Coast Shell fans, can interact with other Chal Nation members and interact with other Coast Shell fans. You can also check the Google Forms link in the description down below where you can send in your video ideas and content suggestions. And for now, guys, let's have a look at my predictions for Kentucky Kingdom. But firstly, we have to have a look at it, see exactly what started all this. So, of course, the main thing from this thing is that a new story. That is what's being trended on their social media. A new story. Now, I'm excited to see what the official release date for this information is going to be, but I am really excited. So it should be interesting to see exactly what we're looking at here in terms of the type of investment. However, I've sort of come to a couple of ideas. Now, firstly, is the um, back off the shelf, brought back to life, Raptor Coaster plans. Now, of course, we did an update uh, a couple of months ago now, about a month or so ago, about Kentucky Kingdom shelving or potentially cancelling, but not officially cancelled, but at the minute it's shelved, RMC Raptor Coaster plans. Now, the reason why I've gone with this is because I think this could be a tease to suggest they may bring that out of retirement and bring it off the shelf and bring it into the theme park. Bring the Raptor Coaster into the theme park and unshelve these plans. Now, the Raptor Coaster is a compact thrill coaster, and I've loved to see that at the park for ages. And overall, I really do want to see exactly what we're looking at here. Um, so, Kentucky Kingdom, in terms of what they could invest, I think the Raptor Coaster is an example of what they could do. Um, I think especially with the, the theme of this map and, you know, charting out the territories and, you know, pointing to the adventure, opening up a new chapter. I think that would be really, really cool for that type of theme for the Raptor Coaster. Um, and I think that maybe they shelved the plans to bring them back in a different way. So maybe it could have been a theming change from an old theme to what the theme of this teaser is. Uh, hashtag a new story. Um, maybe they go with, maybe they shelved it to create a different layout instead. Maybe that's the case. Um, it's, it's different and it's very, very interesting to see exactly what they're going to do. Uh, but I'm really, really excited about this and I cannot wait to see exactly uh, what's going to be announced. But the second idea I've got is sort of a mixture, really. I've got two, I've got two other ideas. The other one, uh, main idea, sort of the more likely of the two uh, with the bonus option afterwards. Uh, the more likely of the two, the other idea would probably be a themed area with a nice flat rides package, four or five new rides, uh, whether that's retheming an attraction and bringing some new attractions around the current th new themed attraction that's currently existing in the park, um, introducing this whole themed area, which I wouldn't be against because I think they can do theming really, really well at the park. So uh, a nice themed area would do really well for America as well, something that's not IP as well, because you look at uh, American theme park areas, you know, the best themed ones, in my personal opinion, Opinion, are sometimes the ones with the uh, it's mostly the ones with the IP that are the better themed in America uh, look at the planet Snoopy slash camp Snoopy areas the Nickelodeon stuff so again this is like an example of what they could do without the IPs but bring in that level of theming which you see with the IP areas now the least likely and the bonus option I've gone with is a Mystic River Falls type water ride I don't know where it would be located but I'm thinking something like that with a, a lift hill 
uh, the tallest drop in the area in the state maybe um, and have a nice authentic storyline and theme around it and you look at what that did for Silver Dollar City Mystic River Falls that was a wonderful attraction for that park a wonderful investment and the right investment at the right time so I think this type of new generation lift hill rapids ride would be wonderful uh, for Kentucky Kingdom. Absolutely wonderful. Uh, so that's my kind of first uh, first ideas. I don't think the park's going to get bought by someone else. I don't think it's going to be um, anything less than a new ride investment, whether that's a new area of investments, a new coaster, or a new ride of some sort. Now, a thrill ride could be a possibility as well. I'd love to see a new thrill ride at the park, but I'm going along the Mystic River Falls type ride because I see the similarities in a new story uh, to the Mystic River Falls story. I kind of see the similarity in that. A new coaster again would be great, whether that's the uh, compact wrapped coaster plans brought back off the shelf or a different kind of roller coaster. Uh, altogether, we'll have to see. In terms of other types of coast i could see maybe they go with something again on that compact scale maybe something like a, a, a i won't expect an sns ride i was going to say free spin there but i don't know why uh, i'm not expecting anything from sns because obviously they've announced their new projects for 2021 so uh, unless this is going to be an announcement for 2022 I, I, we, we don't know the year of this yet so maybe it could be an sns maybe it could be a free spin or an air launch coaster or a brand new sns concept um, maybe it could be that. I mean, we heard we haven't heard any new coaster concepts mentioned when we spoke to uh, Last Lenders uh, in that interview. Go and check out that video, by the way. It was really good. Um, we didn't. There was no discussion of new coaster concepts. Obviously, you heard me say on. The, obviously, he said on the interview there's going to be a new family attraction concept. Maybe as part of the new area, maybe that new concept could be possibly involved in that area they could officially announce the concept once the announce or around the time the announcement officially comes out so uh it could be interesting to see if that goes into effect uh maybe in terms of coaster manufacturers obviously rmc with the raptor intamin with the hot racer maybe they go with that version uh maybe they go with a mac power splash that would be nice and it would fit with that whole new story adventure type theme with the sailing the seas etc because that's what i'm kind of getting from the teaser theming so um that would be wonderful as well like i said the possibilities are endless but this is the first step in an amazing marketing campaign which i think could exist as part of a brand new roller coaster for 2022 i think we're looking at 2022 here uh so thank you very much guys for watching this video make sure you like comment subscribe stay tuned for more on this because i'm very excited about this and for now guys my name is coast shell keep living the coastline and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Excuse me. Take care, guys. Have an awesome day. I hope you do anyway.